Hey folks, so it's Sunday and the store is actually pretty dead. It was busy yesterday so I didn't have much time to do what I'm about to do here. Um, sorting through trucker caps I bought uh, yesterday. So um, there's some that are damaged and uh, stained and such so I've got to go through them and figure out what ones are going to be good for the store ones that'll go online and ones that'll go to the thrift shop and ones that'll just get discarded so i've got four piles to make maybe five piles because some will probably just have the um the patches ripped off them as well so anyway i'm gonna go through them and i'm just gonna sh show you kind of what i do with them first of all the this champion uh has got some staining on the brim i've got this brush with uh, brass bristles in between uh, these other bristles so we'll see if it'll clean off at all oh yeah it does so just some dust or maybe a little touch of mold or something but uh, the it does clean up quite well so that's a good one um, should be able to get oh I don't know maybe 35 45 for that so yeah that's that's all right um trucker caps around here are pretty common um <laughs> seemed like everybody collected them so there's batches of them around all over the place so but there's some neat ones do come out that way because of uh, the quantity just the sheer quantity so that's a that's a neat one the brim is still supple so not cracked or cracking or broken so that'll be a good one for online uh, this conservation officer one, I don't think we can clean it up because these spots, well, maybe, well, maybe we can get it cleaned up. Um, although, I don't know, these spots aren't quite coming off, are they? Well, maybe, yeah, that's fairly clean, really, overall, so maybe we can get it clean enough that we can sell it in the store conservation officer one is kind of neat but uh, might have some crossover collectability as well so maybe we'll put that one in the store and this one will go in the store because it does have just some staining so it's not going to go online it's not quite good enough to to go online so go to the store um, I'm not so sure about these uh, with the solid fabric ones maybe make a separate pile and do a little quick research on them um, i don't think they're going to be anything they might end up going to the thrift shop but we'll we'll check them first and we've got another one like that frock master that would make kind of a neat cap if it was a trucker type cap rather than this style and this has got some staining so you know what that'll just go to the garbage i think yeah i'm not going to use that one too bad unfortunately so that'll just go to trash toss that on the floor and we've got purina again a solid fabric one don't know we'll check it uh it's a local sand and gravel one or fairly local um don't know that one might just go to thrift shop too but again it's solid fabric let's see uh this one's got way too much staining and such on it so that's garbage it's a little gross so garbage and we've got a the silver bullet coors but it's got a big sweat stain on it right here so trash and this one west canadian aviation museum Ooh, it's kind of gross um I don't go to the point of washing them they might clean up and such i but i i get so many that i just don't don't feel there's a need to uh worry about washing this sort of thing and trying to rescue it um what i will do is take the patch off or cut it off maybe i don't know there's not much value in the patch maybe three bucks or something um yeah, so I will slice it out. Oh, no. Okay, I'm going to have to get scissors to do that. So, anyway, I'll toss it aside for the patch. 
Uh, it's a decent trucker one again. Mesh. Um, Mattertuck trucking. Uh, might be worth putting online. We'll see. Uh, Western concrete. Again, that one's kind of a neat with the truck on it. Uh, Snowbirds. Uh, this has got a little bit of dust and stuff on it, so we'll see if it'll clean up. Uh, let's see. Will that come out? Yeah, it does. That's good. Okay. And don't ask me where you can get these brushes, because I have no idea. I'm assuming maybe clothing outlets and such might have cleaning brushes similar to this, but this is an antique or, well, not antique, vintage brush, probably from the 50s or 60s or something like that. Picked it up somewhere. don't remember where now, but uh, that one would be good online, I would think. A little bit of schmutz there. wonder if that'll come out. I've also got a little brass brush. It's meant for cleaning suede, so that might help too, but it's fairly clean. All right, uh, what do we have here? Highways, Northwest Territories Highways, but it's got some mold issues. I really wouldn't want to sell it. So, corduroy, solid corduroy. See if the patch comes off easy. Yeah, it does. Or does it? Or does it? Ugh. Oh, no, gonna have to cut that one off. Actually, it's stained anyway. Yeah, trash. All right. Chisel Lake Joint Venture Excavators. Let's see if the broom will clean up. Yeah, not bad. And I got some neat ones in this batch, so you should uh, stay tuned if you're into trucker caps. Uh, oh, it's missing the little, oh, that one's trash. Missing the little uh, button, so trash. All right, we'll go to the second box full. I got three boxes total, so you'll be able to see what I've got in the three. Uh, Lund Johnson, oh, maybe that one might be okay. I'll check it online. Um, we've got an RCMP. That one would be good for online. Pretty clean. Foam is still decent. You gotta watch the foam on these. So you never know. The, the deteriorating foam is not good. Uh, I've got a couple spots of discoloration or staining, but it comes off. Okay, so yeah, those are clean. Cleans up good. Yeah, it's not really, it's in actually pretty nice shape. So another decent one for online. Uh, Green Lake Lodge. Ooh, got some mold on that one. Does it clean up? Yeah, it does. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's see, what shall we do with that one? Mm, it's got some sweat stains though. Yeah, trash. Never mind. All right. Uh, Bassler Turbo Conversions. So this fellow did some, uh, a lot of airplane repair. So there might be some neat airline or airplane type ones in here. Not airlines, but airplane. That is. So that one might be decent. And I'm not sure what that is, but this one's been worn. And you can hear the brim on this one. Listen to this. Yeah, so <laughs> that's no good. Trash. Uh, let's see. Pendamark, that one's... Uh, this one's got mold and stuff on it, so I'm not even going to bother. We've got a Manto Highways High Visibility one. That one will just go in the maybe check on line about them about that style and this one again a nice champion it cleans up nice it's pretty clean i like these clean ones you don't have to do much to them and we've got mot crash rescue 
Uh, but the foam is toast, and oh my goodness, it's bad. Look at that. Yeah, it's really nasty. Don't want to breathe in any of that. Could clean it up, but it'll be really floppy. So, and it's not in the best of shape. The brim is kind of softish that isn't going to hold a form. So, I think what we're going to do is take the patch off that one. We might be able to sell the patch with being a fire rescue one. So I'll cut it out later. All right, Manitoba Hydro Gen Peg. Uh, this one's got some staining up top, pink, and that probably won't come out. So you can, it's more evident in the uh, in reality than on the video I see. But um, I don't know. Don't know if I want to deal with that one. Um, thrift shop, yeah, thrift shop and oh that one could have been a decent one uh it's got a stain on it though lund boats well, that stain cleaned off that's mark uh oh it's been worn it's got yeah no trash it might have been a good one but not really that great oh this one's neat Ooh, but it's been worn Pretty heavily it's got some sweat stains by the looks of it in here you can see it uh, and the foam is foam is good hmm I don't know about this one um, it kind of cleans up well maybe 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 might put that one in the store might be worthwhile trying that one because it's rolls royce that's uh probably for their airline or airplane motors so that one's kind of neat maybe i'll put it online eventually we'll see and i got another one here flint so on the foam is foam is toast it looks good until you start touching it just watch this yeah so it's toast um i hate unless it's a super good one i'm not too keen about having to tear the foam out so we're gonna just tear the patch off this one i know some people are going oh no no don't do that just clean the foam out but they're mine so anyway garbage for that one salvage the patch get rid of this Okay, Norway House, Manitoba. It's a small northern community. Um, not a lot of people there. But uh, yeah, still a kind of a neat hat. That one might, might sell online okay. Uh, Hay River SO, Hay River Northwest Territories. Now that's probably a really tiny community too, I would bet. I'm not positive, but I think Hay River is pretty tiny. So that's kind of a neat one. That's a three stripe in blue and red. It really pops. So that's neat. That could be a good one. Now, if I sell it on eBay, I'd auction off some of those ones, but not doing that. So uh, Armstrong Perforating Limited. So it's got the buffalo on it. Manitoba, the uh, the uh, provincial animal is the buffalo. So we have a lot of stuff with buffaloes on them. And buffaloes are saleable. So that one's decent for online. Uh, Pearson Welding. So another high vis one. Um, again, I'll check online. And that's another box done. So third box coming up. And let's see what we've got in it. Uh, let's see. KNC Electric. Okay, this cleans off stuff so nice. Um, let's see, it's a corduroy. It has been worn much, if at all. But it is corduroy. I'm not sure if the corduroy ones sell or not. I'll have to check. So, go in the pile of checking. Call your Ford Killarney. A little bit of mold. 
Nope, nope, cleans off good. Doesn't have an odor or anything, so it's just surface. Pretty clean, actually. Quite a clean cap, but again, it's that solid fabric, so I don't know. Anyway, uh, Cabo San Lucas. This one's, eh, I don't know, that one's a little too moldy for me. Garbage. Um, Powell Equipment again. Ooh, yuck. Yeah, no. It's pretty gross inside. Junk. Clark Farms. So that one's kind of a neat camo one. Yeah, okay. Give me that one. Whoa, sorry, folks. Another, we got a Powell Equipment. Uh, a little bit of schmutz there. Whatever. Uh, that one will go in the store. The brim is a little dirty. A little bit of sweat staining there. So, just in the store, it won't go online. And City Center Thompson. Ooh, that cleans up. Yeah, I find this brush indispensable. I use it for all kinds of things, for cleaning tablecloths and caps and everything. Anyway, uh, that one's fairly clean, so that'll go online. And here's a trucker one for Lund Johnson Everude 1993 Classic. So that one will go online. It's pretty clean. We're coming near the end, folks, so hang in there. This is kind of neat. 440 Rescue, S Rescue Squadron, I guess. That's what that is. That's neat. That's a neat one. It's got some foam residue from another one that I got rid of. I did pull out three or four that were really grungy and such that I just tossed before the video, before deciding to do the video. Uh, hmm. This one's got some. Yeah, it's got some head smooched on it. I don't know about that one, guys, but maybe that one's a maybe for online i'll i'll check that probably before but it'll go in the store at least anyway and odd door ostrich mm. yeah i'll just send that one to the thrift shop it's got too much on the brim and yeah tilston homecoming reunion uh we've got a couple marks that are not going to come off and it's also stained here in we've got a pink stain on it that you can't, yeah no we'll just send that to the thrift shop as well just it doesn't make the cut all right uh, next uh, we got churchill oh we got some staining here port of churchill 82 oh it's pretty grungy yeah that one's just gonna have the patch ripped off it and um let's see turnbull seeds and service that was pretty clean um not really exciting but it has the wheat on it which is a little different maybe just put that one oh i noticed we i missed on that ford one i guess i missed that we've got some pink stuff on it so that'll just go to the store where somebody can look it over closely and this one berg's chicks rustle but it's it's missing the little button and stained so we'll just take the patch off that one and we got Ernest petroleum thompson well, that was pretty clean i think that'll as much will come off that hopefully Uh, a little bit. Yeah, that'll be in the store. Not going to worry about putting that one online. Sod Crew. That's a uh, airplane one, which is kind of neat, but it's again, it's that fabric. So we'll just check it online. And last and least, Case Power Winnipeg. So, case dealership, 
something but no real patch or anything on it uh oh it's gross it's been chewed <laughs> okay that's garbage okay that's it folks so yeah that's all the caps um that i got so i paid 50 bucks for all of them for the three boxes so i'll get my money out i'll make some money they're not fast sellers but even if i blew them out at 15 dollars a cap uh there's one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven thirteen fourteen at uh, fifteen dollars a piece so what uh one so oh, what is it almost over two hundred dollars so i'll make money i'll do fine i'll get more than that for some of them but again it's going to be a long haul so i don't know we'll see but there are some neat ones so that one's my favorite hay river with the uh three stripes so that's a cool one so i did a quick resort and did a some a bit of uh sniff testing <laughs> and anything that had an odor uh, whether it be mousy or sweat or any odd odor oil or whatever i got rid of because it's they're just really tough to get rid of odors so anything without an odor i kept so yeah so some had odor so i got rid of them uh salvaged some patches here so i salvaged the rescue squadron ford and a few others some others you saw already so anyway salvaged a few patches because they didn't pass the sniff test or they were damaged too badly or sweat stained or whatever but i did get let's see 6 12 13 Ooh, not a good number oh well <laughs> anyway i got a baker's dozen of good ones or good for listing online anyway uh, i'll still make my money i'll probably triple my money in the end maybe quadruple we'll see so if you're an expert in trucker caps let me know what you think is the best cap here uh, if you're not well just let me know what your favorite is we've got all kinds of course so check them out and leave me a comment below as to what your favorite is all right thanks for watching guys please be sure to like and subscribe and check out our other videos on antiquing picking thrifting scrapping etc take care folks